Hi, hello everybody, this is Panzer Builder and this is my final reveal, final update um, of a Sturm Gashus 3, Stug 3 uh, version CD um, I just finished it uh, yesterday I decided to, you know, to make a short video and just to show it off to you and, 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 and hopefully you're gonna appreciate it, you're gonna like it the same as I like it I'm gonna walk you through afterwards, you know, throughout all the materials I've used to build this one. So uh, I'll show you the model first. So there you go, ready build. And I've decided not to go heavy, you know, with mud and weathering, you know, on this particular one. I've decided to, you know, to to make it as, you know, just slightly weather. Just make it dirty, uh, and 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 I I'm, I think you know came out okay. Um, yeah, I've just changed the tactics on it. You know, previous builds, you know, they were just mud, mud, mud. You know, and but this one is just a bit of staining, you know, soil and earth and bits and pieces. You know, so uh, and more, you know, worn out surfaces. You know, metal, metal you know, showing through. You know, shining through. Um, I hope you're gonna like it uh, because I'm pretty chuffed with it. I put some storage, you know, I build a you know, a cage in the back, you know, railings for storage. I've seen some, you know, pictures online, and there was plenty of vehicles like that, you know, with you know, scratch build, you know, railings on the back to keep the storage on. And I've you know, build a you know, brackets to put the uh, spare wheels. So. Yeah, I'm quite happy. Let's show you under the, underneath. There you go. So a bit of oil staining and stuff like that. So there you go. Yep. The only aftermarket parts I've used for it was the, the towing cable set from, I got it on eBay from a company called Eureka XXL and they were, um, you know, the towing cables looks pretty neat and uh, yeah, I like the way the, the uh, you can see the metal, you know, showing through in, in the places where the paint off, paint was, you know, rubbed off and uh, yeah, and the storage it's for a uh, value gear, uh, which is I've used a similar storage on the Fury tank. Uh, yeah, and I'm just gonna walk you through the um, the materials I've used to build this one, and uh, starting from from here from the primer. I've used the, the white primer then I've used the color modulation set for uh, German grey and I've painted it with this you know set and then afterwards I've uh, I've, I've sealed it with the uh, with the clear and then I painted you know the markings and and and, and then um, I've given it a wash and I started with the the brown blue for the gray vehicles and then I used the interior wash because it has a nice you know like a brown gray you know tint so I've used this one and then uh, did some you know truck wash in some places to just to show a bit of rust and I used the uh, stricken grime and uh, for details you know I've used all sorts of colors you know uh, of course, you know shades of brown for you know all the tools and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, I've used a uh, chipping color. I used uh, dark trucks color to paint the trucks, and I've used the uh, rusty trucks color with the chipping color to achieve you know two tone you know uh, chipping effect. You know, uh, so you can you can have you know like a fresh you know chipping or a bit of. 
uh, red oxy, you know, coming through the paint, you know, and 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 yeah, and it looks 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 fine. And then afterwards, I used the uh, pencil six um, B, which is the soft graphite, and I just just you know rub the places, you know, and and came out great. I would say so. Uh, yeah, I recommend that technique. Uh, it looks great. Uh, it's just, just you know, it's something different than you know natural steel or or, or gun metal. You know, I've used these as well. You know, to paint the uh, tools. And uh, what else? Yeah, I've used the engine oil in some places. You know, on the on the rear deck and then some on, on the hub wheels, um, on the hubs. You know, to to show the a little bit of a stain which you're gonna be able to see it but there's a few stains from the hubs you know from the covers the cups and uh, yeah I've used the pigments light rust medium rust black darker dark earth and uh, European earth and I sealed it with a uh, hand drill dec decal set uh, uh, yeah decal fix I think yeah uh, it works great with it and the wee tail light here, tail light, and uh, I'm sure you can see the periscope lens. See, periscope lens. I've achieved, I've achieved it, achieved it with the UV resin. Uh, this is for fly, you know, for, for fly fishing, for tying the f artificial flies. And it's a, just a clear, you know, resin. And you have to use UV light, you know, to set it. It sets in a, within a second from as uh, soon you're gonna, you know, shine it, shine this, you know, light on the on a place you have, if you have applied, you know, resin. It just sets within, you know, second. And then you can, you know, use a sharpie, you know, marker or whatever, you know, to 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 get the color you want. So uh, because I'm tying some flies and doing a bit of fly fishing, so I have the, you know, material. It cost, I think I, I bought it a few years ago, and I think I paid like five pound on eBay for a set, and that lasts, you know, I've tied, you know, plenty flies, but uh, still have a half a bottle, so it's it's lasts for ages. So, um, but anyway, regarding the uh, the build, I'm I'm quite happy with it. I'm happy with the way it came out, you know. And like I said, you know that that uh, effect of uh, you know metal showing through the rubbed out paint, you know, looks looks great. I think so. Uh, please let me know what you think. Uh, any comments? You know, welcome. And uh, yeah. I'll see, I'll see you on the next builds and yeah this is Panzer Builder thank you very much guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one right cheers bye bye